Hi, it's Paddy and welcome to day 257 of The Daily Do. It helps me to remember when writing The Daily Do that much like a personal trainer, it's repeating certain things that I must encourage you to. For the sake of entertainment, exciting listeners and spice, I could trot out new theories or lists about our lives. But then one of you reminds me that you don't need new tricks each day. It's the bedrock of harmony that we do here, and then you live the variety. So every now and then I remember it's our turn to root out what we're avoiding and get that one thing done. Nothing stops our river flowing like something on our mind. Avoiding one awkward conversation or worrying about money coming in on time. The fallout with a friend that has real fallout in your day. The consequence of unresolved conflict is that you pay. I don't mean sweat the tiny stuff. I mean the thing you're thinking of that shrinks you, colours your day with dark clouds in the sky above. Root it out. You find it just by quietly listening. That thought that keeps on niggling? Yes, that's your thing. You can go on living with it blocked, flowing at half the force you are. But no, give yourself the gift of freedom, accept it's that and start. Even harmonious and simple lives get blocked with life's conflict and debris. So once a month it's good to lift the lid of you and see. What is it that's bugging you? It's this stuff that saps our strength. To focus on our growth, we must resolve these at any length. I won't forget to mention it every now and then, as this freedom from ourselves can become our greatest friend. The liberty you feel when clearing out the block in you is worth that awkward conversation, or whatever you must do. If your sky looks grey and cloudy, ask yourself what storm's inside. Clear the air. Unclip your wings, free yourself and glide. If you enjoy The Daily Do, please share it with your friends. Tell them they can get it on Apple Podcasts, iTunes, Spotify, Castbox and Podbean. Or you can subscribe for a free morning email at www.thedailydo.co or email me anytime, paddy at thedailydo.co. I'd love to hear from you. Or say hi on Instagram, Facebook and Twitter at The Daily Do. Bye for now and see you tomorrow on The Daily Do.